Alright. Here is the best late game method of farming souls. To make this method even better, use silver Kovetu serpent ring and symbol of avarice. I will show you the location of the ring at the end of the video, while symbol of avarice is a rare drop from mimic chests, those chests that are trying to eat you. Spells such as Firestorm and Fire Tempest are best used for this method because they can kill a lot of these bastards immediately and then you just need to clear the rest of them. Afterwards use either Homeward Bone or go by yourself back to the bonfire and reset. Here is how you enter the Painted World. To enter the Painted World you're gonna need a Peculiar Doll, which I'm gonna show you after this. The entrance is in Anorlando. As soon as you get off the balcony and go through this church and use these stairs, there's a path down below. You can control these stairs to go up and down. So play with options and you'll see plenty of different paths. There's also one floor below this one that you can get to where there's a hidden bonfire. Anyway, at the end of this path there will be a huge painting and you can enter it if you have peculiar doll. This is where these enemies that we are farming are at. Peculiar Doll is obtained in the very first cell where you start the game. There will be an item later on that you get by going back to the Undead Asylum. To get back to the Undead Asylum, follow this path and just curl like a ball when there's an option to do so. Silver Kovetu Serpent Ring can be found later in the game in Tomb of the Giants. From this bonfire in this nasty location follow the path and I'm also gonna show you the shortcut to Grave Lord Nito cause it's connected. Be careful, there are nasty enemies here, you can take them out with some higher level spells. I'm walking slowly here on purpose so that you can figure out where I'm at. There's another enemy up ahead but we don't need to fight him, instead we're gonna get to the skeleton archer. And now jump down where this body is. At the end of this path there will be a silver ring, just be careful it's a trap, so be prepared for that. To get to Gravelord Nito faster than usual, you can drop down from this exact location. And you'll get to the path that leads to another cavern and Gravelord Nito will be at the end of it. That would be all. Thank you all for watching. I hope this video helps you and see you soon.